Games Festival. Let's take a look at that story. That is a game of marbles of blindfold catching. How about Langadi or even Gilly Dada or Kavadi? Well, some 1,500 adults and children have the opportunity to go back into time and enjoy traditional games of the past at the Indian Traditional Games Festival 2016, organized by Vivekan Seva Sun. The festival, which featured a host of traditional Indian games for all ages, sought to promote healthy lifestyle as well as preserve this aspect of Indian culture, especially for the younger generation. The main aim of arranging this kind of games is to preserve our traditional games at the same time making the children who are engrossed in the Facebook or uh, social media to come out of their cocoon social setup mixed with everybody so that they will enjoy the benefits of the game at the same time they will know and value our old traditions. Participants agreed that the festival was a good platform to learn about the types of games played in the past. It also showed that people could have fun from the simplest of things instead of being dependent upon modern gadgets. Our children have not, uh, they don't have any uh, chance to know all these games. Uh, because this is the one, uh, I, I thought this one, good chance has to learn the olden games. And they enjoyed a lot, uh, uh, apart from playing the toys, and because this is a new thing for them. Definitely they should know these uh, traditional games because uh, nowadays children are sitting in front of TV and watching games and uh, only with, uh, video games. They are not playing outside. The, this, uh, they should know these traditional games like Lagori and uh, Sagres and Coco, everything. It's good for children. Also. I came here and also participated in some of the games and I came to know um, about our Indian traditional games. I learned how to participate in games and we were, it was fun. Besides being fun, playing traditional games facilitates greater group interaction. This fosters closer friendship and bonding. For some, taking part in the festival brought back sweet memories of the friendships and times when they were younger. Last time, uh, we all were like uh, we were so we were so close to each other. Uh, there was a lot of bonding. I mean, these are the things that create memories. Coming back here and we ourselves playing games. I remember how we used to play marbles and um, how much fun we used to have. You know, if we win the marble uh, competition, we can take the marbles of the friends and go home. So we are rich with more marbles. You know, these kind of things the children are missing actually. As for the children, it gave them an insight into the games their parents had played during their childhood. This helps them better connect with their parents. I played a few games and it was very fun. Um, I, play, uh, I got to know more about the game that my parents used to play when they were younger. So, I feel like more connected. This is the seventh consecutive year the traditional Indian Games Festival is being held. Not only does it bring the community together, but it also keeps the younger generation connected to their colorful cultural groups.